Hi, I am Radha Krishna Pillai. I have been working as a faculty member in the Department of Civil Engineering at IIT Madras for the last about nine years. And uh, my main areas of uh, research uh, is on uh, corrosion and its control in concrete structures and service life estimation of concrete structures and also on uh, repair and maintenance of uh, both conventionally reinforced concrete structures and pre-stress concrete structures. And I've been teaching a graduate level course uh, on uh, repair and rehabilitation of constructed facilities for the last about five years, offering an online course on uh, maintenance and repair of concrete structures. And uh, I'm going to introduce first uh, what, what is the importance of this course or why this course is important for civil engineers. And for example, like, you know, we civil engineers, uh, the cost of corrosion associated with the uh, premature deterioration of concrete structures is about 1 to 2 percent of GDP and which is uh, globally and you know it, this is the number and when probably when we talk about India there is a lot of uh, you know the, these estimates are not really available so we still based on the available data we can say it is more or less uh, 1 to 2 percent or maybe even more. And today the context is much more important because we are constructing a lot of structures and if we do not take care of the quality of construction or you know the durability of these structures uh, then in the near future we will actually have huge amount of repair work uh, which will be sometimes you know uh, very difficult to even manage we may not have enough uh, you know uh, educated engineers to handle such problems and also the manpower. So that makes uh, this course very important uh, you know, in order to train people on how to repair concrete structures and more importantly how to select materials and systems so that the repair will actually last for the intended life or the target life of the structures. And so the, you know, the huge repair industry which is upcoming, uh, you know, can get benefited uh, from this course. Uh, and more, uh, one more thing, this course will focus mainly on preventive maintenance strategy rather than corrective maintenance strategy. What it means is that the course will educate people on how to foresee the potential problems uh, that, can, uh, be, that can be exhibited by the concrete structures and then how do we stop. Uh, from such deterioration uh, from happening. So there is a definitely there is a, a high demand for engineers, supervisors and even workers at site who would know how a repair material or a repair system uh, would work and which is the best available, uh, best available or a most suitable uh, repair strategy that can be adopted so that we can have a corrosion free service life uh, or you know a very durable uh, repaired structure or repair system with minimal uh, additional interventions so we don't want to keep on repairing the structures which are probably that is what we are doing today uh, most of the repairs they tend to fail in about five to six years typically the patch repair work which we usually practice and then uh, what happens is every five to six years we tend to go and re-repair the structure. So the number of repairs which are being uh, you know undertaken on a particular structure keep on increasing and then it costs a lot of money and disturbs the functionality of the facility. So all that can be avoided if we think about durable repair. So that's the key focus on this preventive maintenance strategy and durable repair which can give us corrosion free uh, or damage free uh, you know service life for the structures for uh, you know uh, for most of our infrastructure systems and uh, one more thing which i would like to mention is this type of course is not included in most of the curriculum so i really hope that uh, uh, and there is a huge demand for people uh, who knows about uh, how to repair uh, with durability in mind and i think this will be a really useful course and in this course uh, the most of the uh, course material focuses on the concepts on how various repair materials and systems work how do you choose a particular uh, repair material and systems and we will not really talk about any numerical examples in the course but rather we will 
show you how uh, good and bad practices are uh, there and then try to uh, educate you on what will go wrong if you do it things in a particular way and what is the best practice so that such damage or deterioration cannot or will not happen uh, in concrete structures during the uh, design life of the structure. And, uh, and at the end of this course, you will be uh, able to assess the possible structural and environmental loading which this uh, you know structure is going to experience during the uh, design life or the service life of the structure and then select a durable repair material system so the, there will be a lot of focus on the science behind how different repair materials and systems uh, perform and what are the exposure conditions uh, and what are the uh, in mechanical loading conditions for example a structure which is located in a sea coast and a similar structure which is located in inland maybe the exposure conditions are very different so is it the same repair strategy i mean we need not uh, you know adopt the same repair strategy for these two type of structures so all those concepts will be discussed now very briefly i'll just tell uh, you know uh, how the course will be First, we will talk about the uh, significance of corrosion. Then we will talk about what is the mechanisms behind the corrosion of steel in concrete. And then we will talk about what are the various ways by which the concrete experience or the concrete deteriorates. And then we will talk about how uh, the concrete quality can be assessed uh, or the quality of the uh, steel concrete system can be assessed uh, by non-destructive techniques very briefly and then we will look at how the repair can be done uh, various analysis uh, you know how to assess what type of repair to be done and then we will also talk about structural strengthening and stabilization if there is for example there is a crack in the concrete structure why that crack is happening how that crack can be stabilized or you know how the that element can be strengthened uh, these kind of things will be discussed and also we'll talk about various protection systems for both steel and concrete for example if you're talking about concrete you can uh, we protect the concrete from external environment uh, by applying a thin coating on the concrete surface like anti carbonation coating or uh, you know even uh, waterproofing membranes waterproofing uh, coatings uh, things like that and also uh, how the steel can be protected the embedded steel can be protected from corrosion for example by cathodic protection systems or even cathodic prevention system these slight differences in these two will also be discussed so the course will be uh, covering uh, various topics associated with maintenance repair and rehabilitation of uh, concrete structures in particular and uh, you know i think this will be a very useful course the, for the uh, you know young engineers who are really going to see a lot of repair uh, you know in the future and we should be very ready with technical background and sufficient technical background and ability to think about the uh, the export the uh, environmental and structural loading which the uh, structures experience and design a suitable repair uh, material system so that a uh, very long or desired corrosion free service life can be uh, achieved that means without uh, going again back to the structure without uh, you know repairing or repeating the repair on the structure we can really save a lot of time money and uh, ensure uh, you know undisturbed functionality of the uh, structural systems hope to see you in the class